Okay, so we've got the uh, cap on. Uh, this stays on forever now. You don't need to um, tighten these bolts up that much. You're supposed to lock tighten them, which I've done. Next step is to unplug uh, this hose, which I've done, and undo four bolts on the PCB manifold, and it comes off. Let's have a look inside, see what it looks like. Bit of, bit of crud, bit of oil, but nothing too much. So, yep, yeah, let's bin that and put the new blank on. Okay. Let's have a look in here, see how much crap is in. Bit. No, there's not much rubbish in there. 60,000 miles, so not ready. Okay. Okay, so next I have to thread this nipple into the plate. Once done, we can connect that plate on, and the last thing to do is attach this hose, and then job done. So it takes about 20 minutes all in, and about an hour to take off the engine cover. Okay. So here's a tip. Um, put the bolts in, the top 25 screws in before you put the nipple in because you can't get it in if you see ok ok so everything's fitted my only query was here on the aluminium plate you can maybe see there's a little gap I'm hoping the orange o-ring underneath is seated because you can't compress that anymore especially where the bolt is but this one on the hose went back on easy with plenty of fair liquid. So we'll stick it all back together and start it up. I'm hoping it doesn't leak and it's okay. But we'll report back. That's the BHS there. Okay.